YouTube, what is going on today? We are previewing UFC 218, which features Jose Aldo versus Max Holloway in the main event. Now, in this fight, this is their second fight. The first time, Jose Aldo beat Max Holloway, but at that time, Max Holloway was very young. So we'll see what happens. Max Holloway has been on a tear lately, flying through everybody. He hasn't lost in so long. But Jose Aldo, he thinks he can still come, come back, and you can't really doubt Jose Aldo. He's one of the greatest UFC fighters of all time. Arguably the greatest featherweight of all time with Conor. You can make the argument against him with Conor McGregor, but in my opinion He's still the best featherweight of all time Now Max Holloway. He's been on a tear. We'll see how this fight comes out There's a there's a small chance a very small chance that the winner of this fight could fight Conor McGregor. I Know they both want it Max Holloway's talk some trash Jose Aldo wants Conor McGregor again that fight that 13 second knockout that haunts him that has belittled his career honestly a lot of people look at Jose Aldo a different way in a different way since that knockout happened so we'll see I know he wants to redeem himself uh, Conor McGregor you never know McGregor will fight anybody he doesn't really care necessarily he does 1.5 million pay-per-view buys regardless no matter who he's fighting now will probably be more like in the 2 million range after the Floyd Mayweather fight so we'll see but this fight should be interesting Max Holloway's been on a tear but Jose Aldo, he's so skilled. He's so good. We'll see who wins. We will see. Now, UFC 219 is coming up December 30th, just four weeks after this event, which a lot of the rumors have been Nate Diaz versus Tyron Woodley in the main event. Now, if that happens or not, who knows? But the UFC right now, it's got a string of events going. UFC 217 just happened. GSP returned and won the title. It's hot right now that got a lot of mainstream appeal that event so UFC is kind of on a roll right now so we'll see if they can keep that momentum going into UFC 218 and then into 219 and then maybe McGregor starts to talk about fighting here again it's really ramping up for the UFC it's an exciting time to be a fight fan so yeah we'll see what happens man this McGregor he's starting to stir man he's starting to stir he started that stuff with Mark Goddard you know it's starting to stir you can tell he's starting to think about who he wants to fight you never know. Nate Diaz, Tyron Woodley, maybe they announced that fight and that the winner of that fight will fight Conor McGregor for the 170-pound title, the welterweight title. You never know. So we'll see, man. It's an exciting time to be a fight fan. There's a lot of stuff going on. Does GSP fight again? Does Dillashaw Garbrandt, do they have that second fight? I'm sure they will. That fight was crazy. But yeah, so this fight's coming up next. It's the next main pay-per-view event. I think the co-main event is Alistair Overeem versus Francis Ngannou. So we'll see how that whole fight works out. But yeah, Max Holloway, Jose Aldo, in my opinion, Max Holloway is going to win this fight. Now, you never know. It's fighting. That's why we love it. But in my opinion, Max Holloway will beat Jose Aldo. And who knows where he, where he goes next after this. Frankie Edgar, maybe. I don't know. We'll see, though. But I'm going to conclude this video. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to drop a like, subscribe to my channel. I've been coming out with a lot of UFC content lately. It's going to be coming. I promise. I'm coming back to it. If you enjoyed this video, drop a like, subscribe. Until next time, I'm out.